today, it's all about this. Welcome to Cyber Ridge Robots. So we're talking about recycling. So what do we have here? Well, this is one I made about a year ago. I made it in my apartment before I had this nice workshop to work in. So limited tools, limited space, and I used as many reclaimed things as I could find. So a lot of this is from recycled materials, and I'll take you through it step by step and show you some of those materials. So if we switch them on, it's actually based on a mobility scooter. and controlled by this little toggle that's inside the arm. I can get inside the machine, put my arm in here, and I can drive it around. So let's have a closer look at this. So I'll take you through some of these things here. Here we've got a meat dish. Here we've got some Dyson vacuum cleaner parts, an old grill. Here, inside here, we have a computer fan. Here we have another meat dish, some sort of meat came in this. This is actually a sandwich box. I think you still see the name on there, M&S. Sandwiches came in that. I covered it in a, a brushed metal vinyl wrap. Sprayed it silver. Uh, up here we've got a Cyberman helmet, so adapted. Uh, down here for the weapons, we have a Nerf gun which is cut in half and mounted on the side of what were shoe boxes. Apple juice carton, some other sort of burger cartons here. Um, there's actually a light inside there. I might show that in a minute. Uh, these, these, uh, let's have a look on this side. These were like Actimel drinks, little yogurt drinks. Uh, that's the other half of the Nerf gun there. Whoops. Uh, the, let's come around here. And these were party plates. Yeah, now the tracks, I've had to make dummy tracks because the technicalities of making real tracks. So they just unbolt and come away. So we're now round at the back and we have some beer cans sprayed silver. We have some Dyson vacuum cleaner hose and Dyson bits here, the fold Dysons. And again, a fan from computer. Uh, this is some kind of meat dish, I can't remember now. These uh, yogurt, again, yogurt cartons there. And you can see the tracks. I added this bar at the back, like a wheelie bar, because I had a little bit of a mishap and tipped him over. So he's now got this uh, additional wheelie bar, which is made out of, again, a recycled, uh, it was a gas burner, some kind of portable gas burner, and I cut this up, welded that on there. Off. This has a microphone which I'm going to link to some speakers which are on the front of the unit. I'm going to amplify it a bit more than the original. Now this, uh, first of all this comes off, this was part of the mobility chair covered the batteries. And this is the sandwich box. 
speak. So it's actually what sandwiches came in. And it's made with styrofoam. Just use filler foam just to stiffen it. That's the chest piece. And then the front piece comes off like this. That's the front piece. Okay, that's based on styrofoam. It's a piece of sheet of styrofoam. I think it's actually two pieces stuck together there. Let's give it a bit more rigidity. And then down the bottom. We've got this piece. A piece of wood, I think that is then. A bit of styrofoam again. Again, a lot of recycled. This was an old bedside cabinet, some wood there, which I use for the sides. Uh, you can see the back there of the wheelchair, that's the back of the wheelchair. Uh, these down here. Down here, some recycled loudspeakers I got from a second-hand shop, they're like five pounds. Controls here it used to be for the mobility chair. There's the controls. You see, which is quite good. We got on off. Uh, we got lights. Switch the lights on. A horn. Not very loud. Uh, hazard warning, which does. The back there. Made them red. Well, that's it for today. Well, thank you for watching, and I'll see you again soon.